Hi! Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a holiday or New Year inspired look and I'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible. I've already created this look before and I really liked it. It wasn't actually too hard to create. Uh, so I thought I'd recreate it again. So this is quite like a party glam look. Um, I'll be using glitter on my eyes so it'll be very dramatic. I'm not sure if you can hear my fan in the background, it's the middle of summer so it's quite hot so I'm going to have a fan running throughout this video. Anyways, to start off I'm going to be using the Petit Fee Gold Hydrogel Eye Patches. So it comes in a pack like this and I got these off iHerb. They're basically just under eye, eye gel patches which kind of nicely hydrate your under eyes. To get started I'm going to apply the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer on my eyelids. Cat ears to hold my hair back. Put a little bit of this onto my eyelid just before I prime my lips. So now that I've put that on, I'm gonna apply the Mecca Max the Transformer Nude Eye Primer. So I just recently bought this and I really love it. It's very similar to like the Urban Decay Primer Potion, I find. So I'm going to use the Sanofi Eyeshadow Palette from Mellow. I'm mostly gonna focus on using like the the browns and the nudes just because I'm going to be using glitter. I'm going to start off by using the shade nude and just kind of applying this all over my eyelid with a quite like a large puffy brush. I'm going to apply that like throughout the inner and outer part of my eyes. I guess I'm trying to create like more of a halo eye effect. So for this look I'm going to be using this glitter actually. It's from the brand Glitz. Yes, it's called Copper Penny. So it's like a copper gold. So for the base I'm going to use the shade Cinnamon here. I'm going to apply that throughout the middle of my eyelid. If you want more of like a pigmented effect um, of a bolder effect it's always great to like wet this as well. So I'm just using this as a base with the glitter for now. So using the shade Sinopia and a bit of the shade Blush, I'm going to blend this in a bit more, just with like a fluffy, clean brush. I'm just gonna blend the middle part a bit more into the duochrome. I'm gonna soften the lines out a bit more. Brush it out as well. Alright, so next I'm going to use this eye glue, which is like really dirty. Lash glue that I got from like a Korean shop, so it's just says eye glue. It's technically for your lashes, but it's not really that great of a lash glue. So I'm using it as a glue for the glitter. And this is what the glitter looks like on camera. I'm gonna apply the lash glue kinda more in the center of my eyes. So here, kinda creating like a halo eye with the lash glue. Yeah, so you can blink and kinda make it shift up a bit more so it's more natural. And then I'm just kind of moving it downwards in more of like a triangle pattern, like this. And the same black brush that I applied this shadow with, I'm just going to dab this in it to the glitter and literally just stick it on over the top where I just applied that. There you go. So you just have a bit of glitter in the center of your eyelid. It's just the center of your eyelid only. And then that's it. Go ahead and do the same technique on the other side as well. Go ahead and do the same and apply that glitter, just packing it on. Just like pushing it into the lash glue. Yeah, so that's the glitter in literally just the middle of my eyes. 
And now I'm just gonna blend that shadow back into the glitter. I'm gonna go in with the blush color. And I'm just gonna like add that just to the edges to kind of deepen it a bit more. And to accentuate the fact that there's glitter on the middle of my lids. Sort of blend it out a bit more. So now that I've done that, I'm going to line my lids and then I'm going to apply some fake lashes and then I'm going to do the rest of my makeup. So to line my lids, I'm going to use the Thin Lizzy Perfect Wing Eyeliner. This eyeliner is super convenient and easy to use. I love it. So it's got like an eyelining stamp on one end, which stamps the pattern, obviously, of the wing. And then you can line with the other end. I want to like sharpen up the line. I'm going to apply some lashes now and I'm going to apply these ones off of camera because I'm really bad at applying them on camera. I'm going to add a bit of mascara underneath as like a base to the lashes as well. And I'm just going to like put that over my lashes as a base for the lashes. I'm just going to tight line my waterline as well. Just so it's a bit darker. With that, I'm going to use the Smolder Coal Eyeliner as always. I'm going to apply this just in the top of my waterline, which you've got to do while looking up, kind of. It just helps to like intensify the black liner a bit more, and then use it to color in any gaps that might be there. Put this in my bottom waterline just while I have it with me. I've got my lashes on now. They're very long and dramatic and they complement the look. And now I'm just going to do my base makeup. I'm just going to speed through the process.
that's the look. I'm all done. Added a bit more of the Sinopia shade into my bottom lash line just to kind of smoke it out a bit more. And then I've added a bit of highlighter into the inner corners of my eyes, which is also in the Sinopia palette. So this is a very like glam look. It wasn't actually that hard to achieve, didn't take that long. The glitter looks like this on my eyes. I'm like, yeah, I kind of did this look for Christmas, but I used more gold glitter and then I did a red lip just so it's more Christmassy. And yeah, so this is a great like New Year's look. Well, I hope you enjoyed this look. I'm quite happy with it. It does not take too long at all. And of course, if you wanted, you can like touch it up a bit more and like make it a bit more dramatic than it already is with a red lip too, or like a dark kind of nude dark brown lip would look nice too I think um, because it is a copper it is quite wearable and I'm not wearing any contact lenses other than my clear ones because I'm blind but yeah um, <laughs> so it's a very wearable look and I like it with the nude lip too just a bit more daytime I guess so if you enjoyed this video and if you did please do give it a like and subscribe to my channel Hopefully I'll be trying to make more content soon. I've been kind of slack, but I do love making YouTube videos and also love creating content for Instagram as well. So if you don't follow me on Instagram too, because I kind of post there a bit more frequently, um, it's also Siri X Zero. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you've enjoyed it. And have a happy New Year's and a safe holiday season and don't do anything stupid. <laughs>